In this video, I am going to show you how to use comma separated value in Excel. So basically, I have received a file from my IT department with this following format. So the column names are first name, last name, distinguishing name, ID and email address. So the first name is in this case Lina, then the next one is a Boltman, then the distinguishing is this is the whole is the one value and this is the ID sorry this is the ID and this is the email ID now let's see what happens in Excel so you have a in one particular field has got like a multiple commas okay and then let's see how Excel treats this in this case so I've got a CSV file now when you double click on this uh, csv file now you got first name last name dn id and email but if you auto fit the data now the data is not coming into the as you expected expected format because there is a comma between uh, here 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 and here and some of them has got like uh, additional details like ou details and therefore uh, the data column format has been changed Let's try with a different method. Now use the data option, then get data from file, from text or CSV, then choose the file path, then see. Now Excel is showing you the preview of the column based on 200, first 200 rows. Now even if you choose the entire data set, now this is okay here like first name, last name, DN, ID and email but this data is uh, is not showing into that. If you click on load then you get exactly the same how you got before. Okay, so this is not going to uh, help us. So now how do you overcome this kind of, uh, how do you import the data um, uh, from this into Excel? So, you, so now first um, what I'm going to do is uh, in this uh, entire data the first three characters equal to CN equal to. So what I'm going to do is control C for copy, control H for find and replace and I'm going to replace with double quote then control V. So what I'm going to do is wherever it is going to find I'm going to add a prefix um, uh, double quotes replace all then cancel now you can see there is a uh, double quote then I want same thing here end quote so in this case the pattern is uh, for every line it has got like it, it is going to end with dc equal to GAN test comma local like that now control c control h then control V and this one I need the end quotation so this is the beginning of the quotation and this is the end quotation then replace all then close this so now you can see this entire data is is in the double quote file save then close the file now if you double click the customer data.csv file now Excel is going to show you this entire DN into the single uh, column. So this is uh, one of the trick that you can use for if you have a field that has multiple commas and you need to find a pattern and then uh, put them into the double quote. Now the data is exactly showing into the correct format. Uh, the what are the format that you are looking for. Thank you for watching this video. Happy learning.